Hello everyone, my name is John Ashton and I have been with Greater Manchester Police Museum and Archive for nearly nine years. Another thing that happened in the courtroom was that normally when we have a lot of people coming in, I can't do my talks. I've made a, a standard talk that I put together and I really do enjoy doing it. It takes about 20 minutes to give it. And normally I can have about 70 people sat at the end of the courtroom listening to me, hanging on every word. And um, when we have a lot of people coming in, I cannot do that. We have to get people in and out as fast as possible. So what I did was I actually got the families with youngsters to actually go in a queue quickly and come into the dock. I stand at the side of the dock. The parents take the photograph of the youngsters with me and then it's out in, out in, like that conveyor system. And that worked very, very well. And then one day I was doing that and it kind of eased off. And, um, and this grandma came up with her daughter, who was about 14, and she was very interested in the police, and she was asking me lots of questions. It was really nice. And um, we had a photograph of her in the dock and that as normal. And she was sat in the dock, uh, stood in the dock, and I was actually talking to her. I was outside the dock. And I didn't realize that her grandma was actually, photo uh, actually videoing me until <clears throat> I heard the grandma on my right-hand side say, oh, dear. And I looked round and realized she was videoing me. I said, I hope I haven't brought your video. She went, no, 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 you're covered in orbs. I said, no. She said, honestly, from the top of your helmet to the middle of your chest, you are covered in orbs. There's no one anywhere else. You're, they're just floating down your face and everything. So I said, well, when you finish, let me have a look at that. So she said, yeah. And she, we, we finished the conversation with the daughter and I, the, daughter, uh, the, the granddaughter and I. And then, um, and then she showed me the video and I couldn't really believe it. Because at home, we have a lot of orbs in our house, which we've got used to. And uh, they come out when I'm actually taking photographs, the models that I build. And, um, and one day I had a tank going up and down my room and my sister was taking a video of it. And she said the same thing, this lady. And when we looked at the video, we had 50 orbs going down this tank in about... 15 minutes and it was amazing and um and i now think that either i take something from home to the museum or something from the museum comes home with me and um but this did happen and i said to the lady i said when you go downstairs would you kindly show that to my curator or anyone just to show what is happening and i think she told the curator about it but they actually show it but it was an amazing film and that is me that is what I do, that I enjoy, and things happen now and again.